Hey iPhone 5 fans, this is Spartacus here with another hands-on review for some iPhone 5 cases. What we have today are the last two cases in the OtterBox lineup that we haven't reviewed yet. We have the Reflex Series case and the Prefix Series case. So let's get right down to reviewing these. If you want to see the Commuter and the Defender case, you can check our channel for those reviews. Let's start off though with the Reflex Series case. Now the Reflex Series case is a two-piece case that's been designed for people that like music, that like to plug their iPhone into docks, but still want the protection that OtterBox can afford. It's a very cool case, kind of trendy, probably one of the trendier cases that OtterBox makes. Uh, it comes two pieces as you can see right here. It comes with a self-adhesive screen protector so you can keep your screen safe. The case design is very unique. Um, it has two pieces that slide together and that form one solid protective case. It's uh, made from a couple different kinds of materials. You can see it's semi-transparent on some of these windows. Uh, to give it a little bit of style, you can see the iPhone underneath uh, and it looks kind of cool. It also features some unique uh, air pocket technology, uh, kind of drawn from the crumple zones in cars. Uh, what it does is when it falls, when the case uh, hits the ground, it absorbs the shock and distributes it around the case itself rather than impacting the actual phone. Installation is very simple. Here we have an iPhone. You just slip it on right there and slip it on right here. Now the edges here, this is uh, a hardened silicone that OtterBox has been making. It's a great material. Uh, it's a little bit grippy, a little bit uh, very rigid, and just gives just a little bit, just the right amount. You can see it's a very slim case. It adds almost no bulk to the iPhone itself. You have access to all the buttons very easily. You have to dig in a little bit to get to the mute button, but it's not too bad. It has a raised bevel right here uh, so that you can do lay flat nice and easily. Uh, we'll keep in the actual screen itself safe and if you want to plug it in to a dock you just slide the bottom off nice and fast uh, the case is very very sturdy and you know it's not going to come off unless you want it to uh, so it's not going to come off in your pocket it's not going to fall apart on you as you're using it uh, but it's going to keep the iPhone very safe there are air pockets here on the corners specifically and on the edges a little bit too so that when you drop it it absorbs the shock and then distributes it around the case kind of like in a car instead of impacting the precious cargo inside. We like the big open port here for the camera and the flash so it's not going to interfere and I just I really like the look of this case. It's stylish, it's slick, it's thin. It's probably the thinnest and lightest of all the OtterBox cases uh, while still providing a very very good deal of protection. So if you're looking for a cool case that you want to use that's easily removable, easily installable, and very uh, protective, don't forget about the OtterBox Reflex case. So that's been the Reflex case. Now, let's take a look at the Prefix case. Now the Prefix case is the cheapest and most affordable of all the OtterBox cases for the iPhone 5. It features a one-piece design which is very unique. Uh, this isn't your average one-piece case. Of course, OtterBox doesn't really do anything uh, average. They put a lot of design, a lot of thought into it. Uh, so let's take a closer look. This is the case here. Of course, as with all OtterBox cases, you get the self-adhesive screen protector to keep your screen safe. Uh, but this is the actual case itself. As you can see, it's one piece. It's the easiest to install. You just snap your iPhone right in here. But it's constructed from two different materials, even though it is just one piece. It's slightly flexible. On the outside, you've got the rugged silicone that OtterBox uses, which is a very unique material. It's tougher than some plastic cases I've seen, uh, while at the same time being very, very, very strong. It's going to absorb a shock, it's going to take a lot of beating, but at the same time it's nice and grippy. It doesn't, it's not too grippy, but it has a nice feel to it, a nice soft feel, so that it feels good in your hand. You're not going to be dropping this accidentally, hopefully. But if you do, you're covered. You'll notice it's two materials actually. It, the outside is the silicone, on the inside they've got a polycarbonate backbone that's been bonded to it to give it added rigidity, added strength, and uh, just overall better protection. 
And then the last thing I wanted to point out before I install the actual iPhone, you'll see the backbone is actually cut out in a few different places uh, so that the silicone can come through. Little bumpers here all the way down, which is probably why it's called a backbone. But this actually allows for the iPhone to rest on the silicone instead of on the polycarbonate itself so that it stays a little more protected. You're not going to get the back scuffed or anything because it's never going to be in direct contact with the plastic itself. It'll just be touching the soft silicone. The iPhone installation is a snap. You just push one side in, push the next side in, and you're good to go. Now you're going to see this is a little thicker than the uh, reflex case. It's got a bigger lip here, it's got a little extra lip here, so it's got a lot more protection. It's a very simple design though. Overall, there's not a lot to it on the outside, not a lot to it at all, uh, but it's very functional. You got dust covers here for the home buttons. You've got access to all the ports. Uh, but nothing is going to happen to this phone. It feels just about as safe as if it was in a commuter case. The commuter case, of course, has an external plastic uh, cover on it as well as this silicone on the inside. But at $25, this is a great deal. If you're looking for something that is simple, that is affordable, but offers extreme protection, uh, you're not going to get much better than this. I also like the big cutout in the back with a black ring uh, of plastic so that it, when you take pictures you're not going to get glare from the flash or from external uh, light sources. It'll help reduce the lens flare as well as increase your image quality. So this is the reflex, no, this is the prefix case actually for the OtterBox. This is the reflex case and this has been another review from iPhone5cases.com. You can check the links down below here for more hands-on pictures and thoughts uh, and more in-depth reviews. Thanks a lot for tuning in and we'll catch you later.